So this video is on about the ACL, which is the anterior cruciate ligament in the knee. Obviously this is what you see in basketball players, footballers, and a lot of the time you see these people having surgery. What's already interesting is we already know that um, there's a lot of research done on this subject area, and we know that there are certain high level athletes uh, in the NFL, for example, and in other sports who have no ACL at all. They ruptured it within what they did, they never had surgery on it, they did a load of rehabilitation and they got back and they're performing to a great level with no problems, with no deficits. Now this doesn't mean everyone can get back without surgery um, and it doesn't mean that their ACL has necessarily healed. It could be that they've just got real good, uh, real good strength, real good neuromuscular function back and therefore they're fine. Um, so we already know as well that doing, uh, you know, rehab, which then turns into prehab because it becomes a sticking point of progression, uh, is actually quite beneficial for even if you have surgery. But what was interesting is trying to work out how many people actually the ACL itself actually heals after it's been torn. Uh, and that's what this study that I'm going to talk about now did. They got a study of 102 people who had snapped their ACLs and they looked to see how many, what percentage of them actually healed with no intervention, just did naturally heal. Because remember, the body does heal. And sometimes we forget that and we try and intervene all the time by doing too much sometimes. And what they found is 80%, which is huge, 80% healed. And this is really interesting because if you think about it, if you look at elite sport, how many people have and do go for surgery? Masses, nearly all of them. So this tells you that they might actually be better off allowing time to pass, rehabbing it and seeing if they can get back naturally because surgery may not well be the, the need as such. Um, so anyway, that's it for this video and I'll see you next time.